Hey everybody, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Sophia. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Leave me your thoughts and comments down below. That way I know what you guys wanna see here on my channel. So today's video is actually just gonna be a very simple one, easy one, breezy one. It's gonna be like a vloggy style video. I just went to Trader Joe's. So I wanna show you guys everything that I just picked up. It's a lot. So I'm just gonna start diving in. Um, I'm gonna flip you guys around that way you can see the bags and stuff and then I'll do and oh you fell and then I'll do like a little OOTD later on so let's get rolling um like I said I'm gonna flip you guys around here that way you can kind of just see everything honestly I should have just laid all this out first um but first up I got two bunches of the organic bananas um we go through bananas in this house like crazy so I always 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 buy bananas I put them in smoothies I freeze them I eat them I put them in my breakfast bowls I put them in everything next up I've actually never tried these but these are the barbecue popped ridges mainly got them for my man and then these sounded really good I love taffy this is cherry watermelon and strawberry so I'm excited to try this Next up, just got some broccoli. I'll probably end up freezing this because I don't think I'm going to use it this week for dinners. Um, I got these. These are the golden berries. I've never tried them, but um, there's a dog loose in our neighborhood. But Destiny recommended them, so I went ahead and picked up two of these. The description on the thing where it was sitting looked really yummy, so I got two of those. I got a bunch of gala apples. I love eating apples for something sweet and crunchy when I'm craving it. Got a cucumber because I love cucumber. Um, baby spinach because I put that in my smoothies and I just usually, whoops, I usually just um, immediately freeze this. So I'll probably actually leave that out. Got a white onion. I always buy onions when I'm in the store because you can never have enough of them. Red onion. I got two sweet potatoes to make sweet potato fries. Um, I got, I've never tried these before. These are the chicken and green chili tamales. These are just a really great, easy lunch or dinner to cook up. I got some perfect bars, because I love perfect bars. These are the chocolate chip cookie dough ones. I'm actually gonna throw these in the fridge right now because I was driving home and I don't live super close to Trader Joe's, so. Those will go in there. So first bag is done. So that was pretty much everything in the first bag. Second bag, these are the sliced cremini mushrooms. I got these mainly for omelets. I got some power greens. Once again, my boo-boo, my twin, my life. Destiny always talks about this. It's baby kale, baby chard, baby spinach. She puts that in her smoothies so I'm probably just gonna end up freezing that with the spinach I got another thing destiny told me to get this is the lemony arugula basil salad kit with arugula carrots almonds parmesan basil lemon vinaigrette literally sounds so good I cannot wait to try this um, I'll probably have this for lunch actually because it sounds really good today um, this is just another power green so once again over there um, Destiny, again, she's tried these. These are the jicama wraps. I'm, I'm really excited to try these. I was thinking about making breakfast tacos tomorrow. And then another spinach. Another thing Destiny recommended, you guys, I swear, this girl, she recommends everything good. Um, this is a southwestern chopped salad. I'll probably make this as a side one night for mine and Wyatt's dinner. And then these are so great. These are the vanilla overnight oats. I got a couple of them because they're just really easy breakfasts to like whip up when I'm not really wanting um, my coconut yogurt and I want something a little different or I'll mix coconut yogurt in with this and it's delicious. <laughs> this is another thing Destiny told me to get you guys, I swear. I swear, this is the coconut whipped topping. I was thinking about throwing this on some fresh fruit and eating it for like dessert one night. And then that's just another one of the salad kits. I got the Asian style vegetable stir fry. I was thinking of doing this with like chicken and some 
noodles one night. And then this is the marinated grilled eggplant, zucchini, and red pepper. Destiny told me to get this a while ago, and I just remembered to pick it up, and I saw it. I love eggplant. I actually just had eggplant parmesan last night for dinner. Um, it's my favorite. I love anything with eggplant, so I got this. Um, I'm definitely going to try this sometime this week. And then bag number two, complete. Bag number three is super heavy, so... In the, oh, this was my receipt, by the way. Everything was only 190 bucks. I feel like that is so cheap. Um, so I always buy these when I'm at Trader Joe's. These are the gluten-free everything bagels. They are the best. Highly recommend. Um, these were new, I think. I, or I've never seen them. These are the cookie butter sandwich cookies. Creamy cookie butter spread between two decadent butter cookies. Super excited to try these. Mainly got them for my man, though. And then I got a coconut water because I put this in my smoothies, and my acai bowls, in pretty much everything, and I was running low. And then this, oh my god, I'm so excited for. This is the vegan banana bread with walnuts. Like, does this not just sound amazing? The ingredients are really great, too. Um, it's banana puree, um, unbleached flour, iron yeah the ingredients are really great it's not gluten free but it is vegan so i'm here for that these are also for my man he loves these peanut butter filled pretzels and then i also got some more perfect bars because you can never have too many i love the dark chocolate chip peanut butter the chocolate chip cookie dough one and the trail mix one is bomb so once again Headed to the kitchen, or not the kitchen, I'm in the kitchen. Headed to the fridge. I'll just go ahead, stick those in there. And then, oh my God, I'm so excited for these. These are these sparkling watermelon juices. I've seen so many people talk about these, so I got two of them. It's watermelon juice, carbon dioxide, citric acid, absorbic acid, um, sugars are 12 grams per can, so it is high in sugar, but honestly, um, people said if you mix these with vodka, they're super great, so I might do that this week. And then bag three is complete. I'm actually going to scooch this. Oh my god, this bag looks so good. Um, so these are like my favorite, like, sweet treat when I don't want ice cream or dairy or anything. I love having these in the house. They're so delicious. I also picked up the strawberry ones because I've never tried them and they also looked delicious. Um, this is the frozen bell pepper trio. Once again, Destiny uses this in so many different things. So I was thinking about putting them in an omelet and in like my jicama wraps for my tacos my breakfast tacos i also picked up these cauliflower thins i saw like the recommendations they said you could do like a pizza so i'll try a little mini pizza um and tacos literally anything it's just a bread substitute so love these i've had a brand not the trader joe brand but i've had those before and then i just got this light shredded three cheese blend I got two of these because Destiny said they're so good. You guys, literally, I keep saying Destiny, but honestly, she is the Trader Joe's haul foodie queen. If you're not following her, you definitely need to be following her because she posts the best things ever. I'll leave her um, link to the channel below just so you guys can click on it. I'll make it the first link. That way you don't have to go looking for it, but literally watch her videos. They're so great. So she recommended this to me this is the peppered uncurred turkey bacon i'm really excited to try this um i'll probably do this with breakfast but i was also thinking i could put it on the cauliflower thins for a little pizza and then i just got some shredded mozzarella for my little mini pizzas i'll make um so she said that stella loves these these are the mini hold the cone ice cream cones and this is the chocolate chip one. They look so, so good. I love that they're mini. Um, and the calories are actually pretty good, decent. There's only 280 calories for three cones. Like, is that right? Yeah, three cones is 280 calories. So they're a super low calorie, good treat. I got these because it's been super hot where I live. 
and it's good just to have sweet treats on hand that way you don't go crazy but I also got some pomegranate seeds I love pomegranates so had to get that got some ground not turkey ground chicken um, for a dinner later this week I also got grilled chicken strips. I love buying these from Trader Joe's because I just shred them up and put them on like my salad kits or I'll just eat them like that and it'll be a really great source of protein. And then lastly, this is the Italian style turkey meatloaf topped with tomato sauce. Once again, Destiny recommended this. It looks like it's a really easy, quick meal. Um, so I'm really, really excited. Yeah, so you can do it in a microwave or an oven. I'll probably do it in the oven. I just like cooking in the oven versus a microwave, but I'm really excited for this. I was thinking I could do this with a salad and some like gluten-free pasta one night. So that is it for bag four, you guys, literally. I got so much. Like I said, I got so much and it was only like 190 bucks. So Trader Joe's for the win. Oh, my phone's in here. Let me take all this out. Whew, okay, so next up, I just got some string cheese. It's a really great like snack for me or for like my boyfriend if he wants it. Um, so, and then I got this. This is the matcha green tea unsweetened. The ingredients were really good on it and it just sounded super yummy. All right, and then next up, I have this. I love this stuff so much. It's a great side. It's a gluten-free mac and cheese. It's really, really great. It's super easy side. It takes like five minutes to warm up. And then this is the chana masala. I love Indian food, so I figured this would be a quick dinner over rice as well. Another thing Destiny recommended. Um, I got some acai packets. I bought some at Target the other day. And these ones were like $3 cheaper, I want to say. So I went ahead and picked up one of those. Um, this was also recommended by Destiny, the organic roasted vegetable pizza. Or pizza, <laughs> sorry. Uh, she said it doesn't have much dairy or cheese on it, so that's why I really picked it up. Also, just a quick, easy meal when I don't feel like cooking an actual meal. I got some coconut milk because I'm out. And then lastly, I got this beefless ground beef. Mainly got these for the tacos or for whatever really I want to put in it. I'm really excited to try this. If I'm being honest, I'm going to flip you guys around. Um, so if I'm being honest recently, I just have not been enjoying meat really. Like it just has been like very... I don't know. It's been really grossing me out recently eating meat. So I've been trying not to eat as much. Like, obviously, you know, I'll have it here and there. But I've really cut back how much meat I've been eating. Because like I said, it's just been really grossing me out for some reason. I don't know why. Especially red meat in particular. Like, even thinking about it makes me want to throw up a little bit. Um, so that's why I really wanted to try this out but this is everything that I ended up picking up at Trader Joe's today like I said everything was like 190 bucks so really affordable for everything I got got lots of greens lots of veggies lots of good good things that are good for you so now I'm gonna bring you guys over to my mirror and show you guys my outfit of the day oh it's so bright today I love it um let's see let me flip you around. Um, so, sorry, excuse the cord. I got a little water on me too. I just spilled some. But this is what I'm wearing today. The lighting is so gnarly. It's like really bad. Um, I said it's bright, but it's not it's ready for his walk. Yeah, that's much better. So I'll set you guys down right here so you can see it better. Uh, let's see, yeah. So, whoops, you're a little crooked now. All right, so like I was saying, this is my outfit. Um, these shorts I highly recommend just going in store and checking out, but they're in the shade pink taupe. And then this is what the back looks like. And then the Ebb to Street bra. I love this bra so much. I have it in the white, and I'm thinking about getting it in the black one too, because I'm obsessed. And yeah, this is my outfit of the day. So. 
I'm gonna go take Mac on a walk because I already went to the gym this morning and got my exercise, but he hasn't gotten his. So I'm gonna take him on a walk, put all this food away, and I will see you guys. A hot friggin' mess. I actually have been cleaning all day and organizing. I ordered some stuff for our master. Yeah, I ordered some stuff for our master that should be delivered tomorrow. So excited. <clears throat> I'm so excited, but I'm back um, and I just wanted to show you guys some things that I've done Like I said, I'm looking really ratchet, but I knew my face wasn't gonna be in this that much um, So I want to kind of show you guys my workout gear situation storage um, I was looking for ideas on um, YouTube on Pinterest on Instagram and I could not find a storage that I liked um of course I saw how people stored all their clothes and I got like little ideas of it but this is what I came up with to do for my stuff and what I find I think will work best for me right now. So I'm going to go ahead, flip the camera around and show you guys my This is situation. the front entry door to my room that I have as my own. This was pretty much just my beauty room for like the last five or six years. Um, but yeah, so this is what used to be my beauty room. I say used to because now I just have this little area here. I'm keeping my lights here for now. I'm hoping to move them somewhere permanent. That way I can kind of clear up that and only use them when I film. Um, and then I'm also going to be changing out this wall with this mirror. This wall used to be like a backdrop area that I used to film because the window would bring in tons of light, but I'm over that. So I'm probably gonna take down that mirror and put something else up. Um, that's just my boyfriend's golf stuff. Uh, he used to keep it out in the living room and I didn't like it out there, so I just put it in the corner in here. Um, and then you come around here. And so this is like the corner with all my workout stuff now. Once again, I used to use that as a backdrop when I did a lot of Instagram tutorials. And then in my closet is where all of my makeup storage is when I need everything and then all my everyday makeup is over there. So I wanted to show you guys this because I posted it on Instagram yesterday. I got tons of DMs and questions and all that kind of stuff and actually one girl that DM'd me was like, oh my gosh, that reminds me of how Lululemon does it in store, which I didn't even realize that until she said it and it's true. Lululemon uses like these white cube organizers with the sizes on the side so you can like see the sizes when you're shopping in store and yeah I just really like the way this looks I'm gonna have to get another one um, and I'm thinking about stacking it on top or just putting it there and then moving my rack against this wall but this is what I did for my storage I think it looks really really great I have some baskets coming today from Amazon that I'm putting up there and I'll be putting in like my um, accessories in so socks hats and my sports bras and then all my shoes I'm going to put over there and in the corner but I will show you guys how I organize this in case you're interested so I kind of went based on nothing I kind of just put it all together um, but this is the first cube and the first cube is all of my align leggings so most of my align leggings are the 25 or the 28 I don't have any cropped aligns I really don't like cropped leggings so these are all of my aligns these are the formation camo these are the diamond dye these are the engineered camo titanium gray diamond dye pink taupe black 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 chambray Chianti and then this side is like my wonder unders my wonder trains and Yeah, just like regular wonder unders that are like full-on cotton Um, so you can kind of see like the pattern. I like the same colors and a lot of the same Things as far as legging goes. I don't like to go completely out of the box with leggings um, but I do have some really cool colors. So like I said, these are all Wonder Unders. These the bottom three are more of the cotton ones. These two are like a limited edition special one. I've actually never even worn the black and white ones and I've had them for like a year. Um, but these are Wonder Unders. I've got like the camo, the formation, and black. And then these are Wonder Trains. 
yeah and then these are berries reveals so gray sage cassis navy and diamond dye navel and then this part is like all of my shorts so these are all lululemon shorts and then the back two are just my tna ones i really don't wear the tna ones because they don't have a liner and i prefer to run with liner with with a liner so i have black track that orange trackers white trackers gray track that's i believe and then pink taupe and springtime track that's i got those on sale at lululemon a couple weeks ago love those two colors and then we got my speed ups and this is in the shade serene blue um i got my magenta glow speed ups and a pair of hotty hots and then this is like all of my biker shorts so these are all lines and then these are all wonder trains so these are aligned six inches. These are aligned six inches. They're like the new diamond eye. I have the moon phase four inch, diamond eye 10 inch, Chianti 10 inch, and then wonder train, the dark camo, and the diamond eye navel. And then on this rack, um, this is kind of one of those miscellaneous bottom shelves. I don't know if I'm gonna leave it like this, or if I'm going to change it eventually, but for now it's fine. I just got like Gymshark vests, Target shirts, Amazon shirts, Gymshark cap sleeves, and then all my Gymshark leggings. So I've got Vital Seamless, I've got Camo, also got other Seamless, and then those are just random shorts down there. And then this is all of my tops that I wear to work out. So this is like my favorite top ever. This is the, let me get you like a good, shot this is the cool racer back nulu shorter in the diamond die and then these are all my ebb to train bra or not bras my ebb to train tanks these five i'm actually taking them all in though because i want to get them all hemmed so those are all my ebb to trains just power pivot another like dyed tank um, all yours tees, tanks, 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 and then a couple champion and a couple Adidas. So those are all my tanks. Um, I'm not gonna like go through them all. And then all my bras. So like I said, with the bras, um, I want or I don't want. I'm waiting for my baskets today to get here from Amazon, and I got two to just put right on top. So I'll put the bras in one. And I'll put like all my socks and my hat in the other. And then these are like the main shoes that I brought into this room to keep because these are like the shoes I always go to the gym in or I run in. Um, I will work out in my Yeezys occasionally, but I'm going to leave those stored away because um, these are more of like my everyday gym shoes. These are my current favorites. They're the Nike Infinities. They're so, so good. I love them. And then I also have some Ultra Boost. Ultra Boost are also one of my favorite shoes. Um, completely different than the Nike ones though. The Nike ones have more of like, um, I don't wanna say a bounce, but they feel more stable and they kind of push you forward. If you can see like the back of it kind of pushes you forward. When I do leg day, I like to do Ultra Boost because I don't feel like I'm pushing my body forward if that makes sense. And then these are my Brooks tie dyes that I use to do outdoor training or running in. And then these are just another pair of Nike Infinities in white and like pink. And then my Adidas White Ultra Boost, which my boyfriend has to lace for me. So that's pretty much like, my workout area, my beauty room situation that we have going on right now in my household. Um, but like I said, I wanted to just show you guys this. So if you were curious or you wanted to do something like this in maybe a spare bedroom or spare area or wall in your home, you can do it. Super easy. I think that like cube thing cost me $70 maybe. I've had the clothing rack for years and it was super affordable. So it's just a really quick, easy way to organize and declutter. All this stuff was in our master like on one wall and it was just taking up so much room and everything was just cluttered. So I'm happy to like finally organize and get everything done. Um, that's kind of all I wanted to do for this vlog because I think it's going to be a kind of long vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like always, give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments down below. And without further ado, thank you guys for watching. Bye guys.